Hello YouTube. Today I'm going to show you how to change out your high beam light bulb on a GMC Envoy. This is the same process on all Envoys ranging from 2002 to 2009. I will be upgrading to LED. I bought a nice pair of Oxido LED light bulbs. Yes, they were a little bit expensive, but boy are they really worth it. If you want to buy anything from Oxido in the future, make sure to use my promo code which is called GMC Lincoln to receive 15% off any purchase. Link in the description below. I did a review on these bulbs, so check them out on my channel. Show your support by hitting that subscribe button. Let's get right into the video, shall we? For this project, you're going to need a flathead screwdriver, new bulbs, and a pair of gloves. Start off by pulling on these two tabs above the headlight housing. You may have to use your flathead screwdriver to help you out here, but once these two tabs are released, you can slowly pull the headlight housing towards you. Be careful as there are still wires connected in the back. Grab your flathead screwdriver and use it to unclip the main wire powering the high beams and low beams. Then you can twist the other two connections counterclockwise to release them. You don't have to completely remove the headlight housing, I'm just doing it for demonstration purposes. The same procedure goes to the other headlight as well, so I'm going to fast forward as I'm going to remove the other headlight assembly. I highly recommend using gloves for this part. Luckily, gloves came standard with the purchase of these Oxido LED lights. The high beam bulb is the one below the low beam, so go ahead and remove the circle cover. Twist the bulb counterclockwise to remove the bulb from the housing. Now you can unclip the bulb from the wire. These are the old halogens, so I'm going to replace them with the new Oxido LED light bulbs I bought. As you can see, it's the exact same connection type. I'm just going to connect the wire to the new LED bulb and insert it back into the housing. You may have some hard time finding the correct position, but once you do, twist the bulb clockwise to lock it into place. Make sure to put back the circle cover. I'm going to fast forward as I change out the bulb on the other headlight assembly. Now we can put the headlight housing back into the vehicle. Start off by inserting the two light connections on the side of the housing and twisting them clockwise until they lock. Then clip back the main connection. Before going any further, make sure the bulbs are working, so take a few seconds to try them out. Once the wires are connected, you can push the headlight housing back and align it with the holes on the tab. You can now press the tab down and fully lock the headlight housing in place. I'm going to fast forward as I do the other headlight. That's pretty much it folks. Here's a quick comparison of the halogen and the LED light. Check out my full review on these headlight bulbs. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please hit that subscribe button and show your support. And don't forget, if you ever want to buy anything on Oxido, use my promo code GMCLINCOLN and get 15% off. See you guys all next time.